Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today we are going to start a new hobby on this gross, kind of crummy day uh, in Washington. Um, we're gonna get into archery. So I've been wanting to do this for like five years. This Christmas, Porter got a brand new compound bow. So we're gonna head over to Lucky Shot Archery and check out the bows, see if we can find something that's gonna work. All right, we're on our way. Kinda wanna see what the sound is like while it's pouring down rain. So I'm using the new Canon M50. I think this is gonna be the first official uh, vlog that I do with the Canon M50. So there are things that I like about it, there's things that I don't like about it. Before I was just using the GoPros. So the last video I think was the Christmas tree video and it just used uh, GoPro Hero 8. I'm hoping this is better. What do you think, kiddo? Do you like the new camera? Yeah, I do. Since it's so crummy out, typical Washington uh, winter, uh, it's gonna be nice to be in an indoor archery range. So not only to, to get everything calibrated and everything, but it'll be a nice place that we can go use uh, on, you know, crummy or cold days. Like, well, give me... we're going to the archery range um, and I got my bow, see? So we have been there one other time and uh, this time I think I've narrowed it down to which bow I want or at least between two. Bump. Oh, oh man, we're really testing the limits of this image stabilization. All right, we are here. There's a few people here. Oh yeah, kind of busy. All right. So this is Lucky Shot. Oh, you went, you went black? He's going with the black. <laughs> I can't, I don't want to wait two weeks. <laughs> yeah, bro. I'm just going to do it. No. And you said you were thinking about some kind of red highlights. I'm not yeah, going to be able to get like, red. Yeah. I won't get, uh, you know, I can do a red E loop. Okay, yeah, that'd be cool. Uh, things like that. So right now I'm just setting in your D loop. I already had your knock set. I already tied that in okay. a second ago. Well, that was the red line. That red line, yeah. That's just a knock set, and then the D loop will actually, you know, be yeah. your release will clip to that. So that's set, and now I will set your mod. So that we have the right mod on there, and then we'll go uh, get into the paper tuning and see how it shoots. So the nice thing about the this VXR, I I actually prefer the mod systems. They tend to run a little bit more efficiently. I really like the draw weight uh, adjustment. Right. Is it just with a mod? Yeah, you just change the mod. So you pick your, your draw length and weight. Correct. Specific to the mod. Yep. Draw length and weight. And so you don't have to change off. the let off, also let off is part of it as well. Uh, on the VXR, you have an option for an 80 or an 85 percent let off. Mm -hmm. Like what were you saying? This, These are, this is a going to be an 85 percent let off, 65 pound mod at 31 inches. And then there's a very long draw length. <laughs> We have a slight right tear, a little bit of a right tear. The, air, the point of the arrow went through right there. The fletchings of the arrow went through right there. Gotcha. That's telling me I want to move my arrow rest a little to the left and see if we can clean that up. Bingo. So that's oh, what yeah. we're looking for in a perfect hole. So you see we have a little hole right there, two small rips, or three small rips for each fletching, and the arrow went right through the center. Yeah, okay, cool. 
So that's perfect. Yeah, that's pretty busy. Yeah, right now we're right now we're slammed. And it's New Year's Eve. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna be kind of slow today. I was like, oh, this would be perfect. <laughs> right. Slow. Yeah, we can never we never can predict it, but we like the business. So. It's like the fire service. <laughs> So now that we're set on our our axes are set, we will just mount it. Awesome. And then I'm gonna I'll save the feet so that we. And when you pull your so when you come to the back to full draw, find your anchor. Okay. We're gonna try to look right through this and. At the site, for the end of the side. Maybe kind of up or down. And it feels alright. It looks, looks good. It looks really good. Okay. And it's, are you looking right through that, uh, the, through the side aperture? Yep. Yeah, that looks good. Go ahead and let it down. Yeah, that's fine. Awesome. All right, I'll go tie that in. Cool. So what, right now what I'm doing is I'm tying in this peep and it's gonna lock that peep in so it doesn't move. Five, six, seven for luck. something different something new well this my my something different is apparently what everybody else wants <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it's not it's just been one of the it's a color that's just done really it's really cool good. yeah all right so it's time to test this uh, bow out max came over for a bit so we're going to give it uh, give it a little go through oh yes I noticed you got a, a, a fine whisker biscuit here. Oh yeah. Is that yep. a walrus? Uh, yeah, probably. Yeah. Some sort of marine animal. Cubes. Wow, it's bright. Huh? Ah, so bright. Nice. Here we go. I'm getting excited already. Have you, have you been slapped in the wrist yet? Uh, you're not, not wearing, with this bow. You're not wearing your wrist guard. I, no, I, know. I didn't buy a wrist guard. <laughs> you didn't buy wrist no. guards. Are, what? Yeah. No, you say that until you slap her. I have, but not with my bow. guys for those of you that didn't catch in the video here is the final build this is the Matthews VXR in a 31 and a half inch axle to axle I'm brand new to archery but so far this has been a really good one I shot a whole bunch of bows uh, to find this one and this one just felt the best so I've got the black gold pro sight on here uh, it's a little more expensive but it's pretty bulletproof it sounds like and has a lifetime warranty I've also got the Matthews Q Light quiver on here. It is not a removable quiver, but it is really, really light. So I went with that. It sits pretty low profile, and we'll see how that goes. Right now, I just have a Trophy Ridge whisker biscuit on it, and I'm going to use that while I'm learning and also waiting for the Vapor Trail Gen 7X to be available with the Matthews specific mount. I've decided to go with a red and black theme, so gradually I'll add some more red accents to it. Originally, I looked at the ambush green and the the shop ran out of them They had a whole bunch of them and they'd sold them all so Instead of waiting the two weeks as you may have caught in the video I decided to just go with the black one which was a very close second choice for me I generally get things in black. That's just kind of my my thing. I like the matte black finishes All right, so as far as the big news 
big announcement. The big announcement is that I will be in Las Vegas coming up shortly for SHOT Show 2020. Max Powell and I have been invited by Beyond Clothing and 5.11 Tactical uh, to, uh, to go to SHOT Show with them. I'm not sure exactly what the plan or the itinerary is, so if you have anything you'd like to see at SHOT Show, please put that down in the comments. I'm gonna do my best to get as much of the new information out to you guys. Well, that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like what you're seeing, please hit that like and subscribe and click that notification bell if you'd like to be notified when I release new videos. I'll see you on the next one.